you want to be the best pianist of all time? Do you want to win all gigs just with your fingers? It is easy as pronouncing Do Re Mi Fa Sol La Ti Do. Play like a pro with Emmanuel Lugue. Subscribe, drop a comment and share with your friends. Yes, hi guys. Uh, thank you so much for joining me again for uh, another lesson. Now, uh, this is Emmanuel, and uh, today I'm going to give you um, a group of chords that is the augmented chords. I'm going to show you how you can form them, and then sometime later or uh, in the next time I will show you how to use augmented chords. Now, uh, as I told you earlier that you can never understand these chords or you cannot understand augmented chords, diminished chords, minor chords, uh, ninths, and whatever. You cannot understand these chords if you don't know how, if you don't know the scale of a certain key. So first you need to understand the scale. You first need to understand the scale and then you know how to form major chords minor chords and uh, the foundational chords so you cannot also know how to form the augmented chords if you don't know how to form a major triad now for instance we are in the key of c let's take for instance the key of c um, so this is the key of c this is a c major it's c major so we build major chord by playing the root third and fifth of the major scale, I think we know that. So uh, we have the root third and fifth of the major scale. So this is a C triad. This is a C triad. Now it is very easy to understand chords as long as you know the foundational uh, background of the chords. So as long as you understand the foundational chords, it is easy for you to build uh, these chords. All right. So. Um, this is a C major triad. I have C, I have E, and I have G. So I have one, three, and five. If I flatten the third, this is a C minor. If I flatten again the fifth, this is a C diminished. Now, back to the C major triad. We build augmented chords by playing the root third and sharp five. So we raise the fifth. We raise the fifth by a half tone. So we said also a half tone is a distance between two keys. From one key to the immediate next, it's a half tone. From one key uh, 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 to the immediate next and then the other one, that is a full tone. So a full tone is a distance between three keys. A half tone is a distance between two keys. I need you to understand this theory so that it becomes easy for you to build uh, these chords. Now, we said that this is a C major triad. C major triad. So we build uh, augmented chords by playing the root. So for instance, the scale of C. So we have the root, that is C. We have uh, the third, that is E. And then the fifth is the G. So we, we, we raise, we sharpen the G with a half tone. So it comes to G sharp. So this is a, a C augmented chord. C augmented chord. Now when you can hear clearly augmented chords, they cause a lot of tension or they can create tension. So for now, I just want you to understand how you can build the augmented chords. And then later I'll show you how they are being used. So this is a, a C augmented chord. Let's take another example. Uh, let's go to the key of uh, which key? We can just go uh, up the scale, up uh, or chromatically. So from C, this is a C augmented chord. C augmented chord. Let's go to the key of C sharp. So uh, uh, we have the the root that uh, G. Uh, yes, G sharp is the fifth. So we sharpen G sharp into A. So we have uh, C 
C-sharp augmented chord. We have C-sharp augmented chord. Let's go to the key of D. So we have uh, a, a D major triad. We sharpen the fifth. A is the fifth in the key of D. So it comes to B flat or uh, A sharp. So this is a D. This is a D augmented triad. D augmented triad. To the key of D sharp. A D sharp is one. G is 3 and then the 5th is the A sharp. So we raise the A sharp into B. So we have D sharp augmented triad. D sharp augmented triad. Let's go to the key of E. So E is the first. Uh, G sharp is the third and then we have B as the fifth. So we raise B into C. So this is an E. Augmented triad. E augmented triad. The key of F. We raise the C into C sharp. So this is an F augmented triad. F augmented triad. We go to the key of F sharp. And we raise C sharp into D. So this is an F sharp augmented the key of G. So this is G major triad. We raise the D. We have a D, a G augmented triad. G augmented triad. We go to the key of G sharp. So we raise the D sharp into E. So we have G sharp augmented triad. Triad. Go to the key of A. This is A major triad. So we raise the 5 to F or E to F. So we have an A augmented triad. Augmented triad. We go to the key of B flat. We raise the F into F sharp. So we have B flat or A sharp augmented triad. Augmented triad. We go to the key of B. So we raise F sharp into G. We have B augmented triad. B augmented triad. Yeah, so that is, it's very simple to create these chords. As long as you understand the scale and you are aware of the major chords, the foundational chords, it is easy for you to create these chords. All right, so the next time I'll, I'm going to show you how you can apply the augmented Codes. I'm going to show you how you can apply the augmented codes. Remember to subscribe if it's your first time to be this channel uh, so that you'll be the first person to get my content or get my lessons. You hit the notification bell so that you'll be the first one to get uh, these lessons. Thank you so much. I'm going to see you the next lesson.